Oh, well. Actually, against armor 9, Claw is better than Mighty Blow, so this isn't such a bad game to have. <laughs> yeah, rest of development. That is the that is the number one is the number one thing, isn't it? You know, Clawpom is Clawpom is what it's a jungle out there, and you're either piling or getting piled. <laughs> um, don't want, I don't think I'll get anything. You shouldn't have too many skills. Block, block on the beast. <laughs> block on a warrior. Extra arms. <laughs> Zapo Fagor. <laughs> That's a great name. <laughs> All the others are like, all the others are just like weird, weird, weird Russian names. <laughs> He's got Zappo Fagor. Oh, I love the Fagors. Uh, three one one. I mean, the 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 beast can be a pain in the ass if he gets a if he gets a gutter on it. But um, yeah, he doesn't. And he he's got the two plus pickups, so he's not in as much trouble as he could have been if he was if he didn't have if he didn't have anything. If he didn't have any ball handling skills, he'd be in a world of hurt. But he doesn't have a block on the carrier, so but then block wouldn't matter with a wrestle, a wrestle gutter. No, I guess a storm vermin could. Russian Lupak, yeah. Yeah, the Beast of Nurgle can be a pain in the ass for sure. Right. Um, receive the ball. I'll kick, kick, and then I've got the one turn. I don't know. More, more players to do the one turn. I do have less strength on the pitch now that I don't have a reserve. I, I only like fielding three doubles, believe it or not. Um, so, there you go. Yeah, I guess that's good. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> that sounds about right to Boris. Yeah. Yeah, that's why C comes OP. Yeah, because you know, seven seventy se uh, rolling a seven on two dice is like over fifty percent, isn't it? Don't know what it is. About sixty percent. And then you've got that plus another one, haven't you? So um, so yeah. Ish. Sea Palm is pretty OP. Yeah, exactly. Lemon is good, yeah. yeah. Yes, Gherkin, I'll drop the Rogue as soon as uh, as soon as he just gets killed, basically. Yeah, Vamps then no, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the Vamps was a bit of a massacre. Could have easily been 4-0, but I'm 3-1, so it's alright. It will tot. <laughs> I like the old throw. All right. <laughs> I do. I do like the old throw. All right. And give him strong arm. Strong arm's great. <laughs> catch toy. Yeah, you. <laughs> oh god, that guy had catch on both bull sentinels. <gasps> what a waste. He could have had two dodge bull sentinels, and he had two catch bull sentinels. That really made me sad. Yes. The. The the mythical developed slan will show up and not be torn to shreds. I mean, Andy Davos developed slan on Chance Ladder was an amazing team at the start of the tournament, but he took some cars and then by the time he got to play, by the time he got to play uh, Ducky, his team was fucked, wasn't it? Basically. So, yeah, that's true. Even even if you do have a mythical developed slan team, you can still just lose the toss to Chaos and. Take four removals, turn one, and feel bad. But that's the thing. The problem with them is winning the tournament is the the attrition over the the various rounds, isn't it? Oh god, my eyes are fucking killing me here. Might be best to turn off the camera. <laughs> Hello, Crystal Hunter. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this, it was a desperation move this season, just because uh, just because I was losing all the games, and El Mato was like, "Why don't you just use an overpowered team?" You scared him, and I was like, "All right then, El Mato, 
and uh, so he's not he's not he's not going for a two plus pickup against Skaven he thinks uh, he thinks securing the ball not that important I'll take a risk I'll take a chance on the three plus pickup oh yeah I guess this is bad isn't it I probably shouldn't have done this because you can blitz him and then stick him on two guys then I can I can roll with him so. I could claw him even. I did try Skaven before and uh, I think I did. It was a draw or a loss. I can't remember. It was it was really it was a really fucking stupid game that I had with the Skaven. Skaven versus uh, Pro Wells it was. Yeah, I think I lost. I think I actually did lose. Uh, yeah, I think so. <laughs> Three easy matchups and 51 GFI shot. Oh well, he gets cast because I have four gutters. That's that's good, isn't it? <laughs> that's good. Might as well apple him because you know, fuck the players at this point. Game three, isn't it? the three plus pick up. What an arse lock. Mm. It's going pretty far forward there, isn't it? Not sure that's such a good idea. Right, so I need an assist there. And somebody cancelling here. And somebody cancelling here. <laughs> here comes the hit. Oh, <laughs> instant! Instant payoff. I meant, I meant to like power him, you know. That was the plan. It's not, it's not stuck anyway, is it? At the end of the day, he's not really much so much stuck on the beast as getting three dice powered by the beast. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, how would I rank? It depends on one. It depends because it depends if you rank them in order of just how good the player is, or how good they are on the team in the context of the team. You know, that's the thing, isn't it? So yeah, exactly. You don't exactly. <laughs> Beast is stuck on the gut there. <laughs> And then he rolled a one anyway, so it's all right. So, good. That was a very nice really stupid, wasn't it? Incredible. It was just incredible. Oh man, stop fucking, stop fucking me up. Oh. <laughs> Call outside, eh? Wow. Oh, you're hot. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ow. She punched me. <laughs> <laughs> Not like that. <laughs>
<laughs> Took hero of foul appearance. No, I'd give him dirty player. He's getting dirty player. 100%. Like he can one. He can one dice here. He can pow him. He can guard there and then get a one dice and ball. Um. Maybe not. Don't know if there was a one dice. I don't think there is a one dice in the ball. Maybe I one dice him. Maybe I could chain him. Mm -hmm. Two dicing him is obviously good. But what's the point if it doesn't get me anywhere? Maybe it's better to one dice with him. And then I could one dice the ball. Because I don't see how I one dice the ball any other way. Could dodge with him, I guess. Start with a roger. Start with roger fun. Good. would be really good. Oh, I followed up! <laughs> oh, I followed up! So the plan there was to not follow up. It's not the end of the world. Actually, this works out better. This literally works out better. For fuck's sake, Tony! Stop being shit! <laughs> do I hit without block? Or do I uh, dodge to hit with block? I guess I just hit without block. Skaven. Misplay, get rewarded. Just Skaven things. Hmm. I kind of don't want to just get, you know, powered. But I guess I've just got to go for it. Maybe I should have dodged this guy first. What other, what other team could you completely fuck up your hit on the ball and then actually get a better hit on the ball? Fucking scale. Why not throw it downfield? Because I couldn't. If I was in two disturbing presences. I mean, I could have GFI'd and then thrown it, I guess. But um, that would be, be two more double twos. That would that'd be two more two pluses that I'd have to re-roll. Um, don't know. Maybe I could have done. But it's not easy for him here, is it? Because he stood up. So, he, you know, if he 2Ds with one of these, he doesn't get three dice. He doesn't get three dice on the ball. He only gets two dice on the ball. And he doesn't get a re So he'd have to recover the guy who knocks him down. <laughs> 1D pow skull. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, maybe I should have GFI'd and, and punted it. I just fucking hate punting. <laughs> yeah, maybe that should have done. Maybe that should have done. But he's got to recover. 
and protect it against Skaven. I don't know, I just don't like I just don't like fucking punting it. I really just don't like fucking punting it. I really don't. Like how does he protect the ball now? Like, okay, well done mate. You got lucky, you got the pow. You got literally as lucky as you could get. You're still gonna get two dice by a gutter run next turn. <laughs> So, it's like, I don't know, I just didn't feel the need to, to yeah, the other was almost a certain score. Yeah, yeah, I can see the point. I just like having it when I've got, when I've got the ball, I like keeping it. <laughs> I don't know, I, I, I remember the, the last two times I've punted, I've lost, well, I don't know, I drew a game because I punted, and uh, other things have happened because I punted. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> pushed it even closer to the end zone for us. <laughs> uh, do I make some safe moves first? Yeah, okay. Stand him up. Stand him up. This guy isn't there. Some dodge and two dice again. So is this three plus dodge or there's this block? I really don't like got a runner to get fucked. So get him out. I take the safe one dies for <laughs> Pedro. Uh, Alright, let's finish it on the safe one dice. Yeah, good. Good. And um, this actually is really nice. Three plus, isn't it? I guess I'm not going to make two tackle, two tennis rolls. Though. Standard. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. Arrested Development. I really don't like. I really don't like punting as a rule. I, I'm, I'm aware that I don't punt as much as I should. I just generally write it off as a as an option. Um, and yeah, this time when obviously I clearly I shouldn't write it off. Like then, maybe I should have done it. Mr. Cheat is his cheaty best. Yeah, that was pretty cheaty, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, the tents, you know, they're not that good, are they, really? But he's got a three plus out. Maybe he's, uh, this, these dodges were a bit difficult, otherwise I'd have stood here, so I'd do a four plus dodge. But then I thought also this way. The ball can't go in the crowd, can it? If, he to, if I'd stood there, it would have made his dodge harder, but then he, the ball could have gone in the crowd, which I didn't really want. And I've got it here. I guess I want to start hand off to the other gutter, or pass to the other gutter runner, to go up to 13. It would be good, wouldn't it? Oh, oh he's got block. Bastard. Can no go with block? What the hell? What the hell, man? Tense or tail? Tense if you can choose. I would never give a player ten, uh, tail. And I would often give people tens, but only strength four. I guess I used to give strength three tens. So strength three if you take, if you, strength three for tail and strength four tens. Yeah. Tense does things against everybody. Like, you know, ten, my, I, I remember I, strength three tens has won me games before, you know, with uh, that, that crappy star player. But, um, 
Let's see what we have here. Blitz um, with him. I'll just block. Guess blitz for this guy. Pretty annoying. Got a pass to him. Score this turn. Guess so. Should have gone a lot further over here, shouldn't I? This is a bit greedy. Bit greedy. Bit greedy, but it's scathing, so I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed well no, I would have I would have done a safer stall um if I hadn't if I'd knocked him over. I would have actually just like you know done a safer pass and stall. But uh, it had to be quite risky going for the pass that way, or I could have done a handoff and you know, I I I trapped myself into making a risky one. Um, so yeah, right. Let's have him back now. Now that I've realised the error of my ways. Uh, like this. It's gonna be better, isn't it? So now that is El Mato a touchdown away from levelling now. And so <laughs> what I, what ideally would happen would be backyard Dodo would pass it to Wild Blue now for the. And then that levels him up, levels him up, and uh, Mull's, Mully D gets the MVP, and then everything's good, isn't it? Didn't even use a reroll. Oh, no, I'd used one reroll. Can't remember one more. Two this season. Oh, that's good. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, BZL the genius. BZL the genius. Glorious. Oh, P.I. No. Oh, well, 2-2 two, two is all right. Oh, 3-2. That's still good for me, though. Oh, no, 2-2. Two, two. Still good for me overall. No. Oh, please don't spam it, everybody. Please don't spam it. <laughs> Manly plus baby. Yeah. <laughs> yeah it's, it's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool thing, isn't it? Thank you very much, Beezy. Yeah. yeah, maybe it should be on a on a longer cooldown because people are going to try and do it. Oh, well, on the back, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dynamodes. I thought it was Dynamo Des, but Dynamo. It's pretty cool, isn't it? <laughs> right, can I, I can get three assists to claw the uh Claw him. Yeah. <laughs> the only two people that can read. Uh, <laughs> right. Ah, so he's, he's, he's salvaged this. Um, I could put a player here and a player here and a player here. And get two dice on him. I just wanna I just wanna hit the big guys off each other. Or maybe I should be more focused on the ball, could blitz him. 
and uh, then split the team up very nicely. Maybe that is the way. We could go all the way around to here. And then GFI and then block him. Don't like the GFI there. Oh, I could just come in this way. Duh. Come in that way might be worth it. Not really getting to benefit from this uh, the weak LOS though then, am I? I'd like to benefit from the weak LOS. I'd like to put a bunch of players here and make it difficult for him. But then where does the blitz come? Maybe there, and then he ties them up. Yeah, right. There's still just a two plus three, isn't there? So now he's tying up all of those guys. That seems good, doesn't it? Hooked up. Face, face, face. Fine, then I can punch him. No, I can punch him as well. What about this guy? Maybe I shouldn't have used that. Meet the fucking beast, idiot. Idiot. I can't make a G yeah, Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Maybe I should have made, made those moves before making that block. And obviously, I shouldn't have done this. anyway or blitz with a beast three dice with block and mighty blow pretty good hitting that got a runner isn't it hmm. <laughs> yeah you've got to do it including capitalization and everything perfectly how am I <laughs> or was it just for a joke? <laughs> I thought he'd really stupid then because it said, oh god, this is going to be bad, isn't it? He's got block. Fuck. Maybe I shouldn't have. I think it's V and then a space and then search. But not a capital T. 
<laughs> Ducky's, yeah, I don't know, maybe that's on the cooldown. I'm pretty sure Ducky isn't a capital D. Yeah, Moles. Moles about 80, I think. Yeah, it was right of him to not make this block, because obviously he wanted uh, stuff there, didn't he? GFI the fucking one dice with a loner. I don't even hate that. Like I literally don't even how stupid is that I don't even hate that because just the play the payoff is just so fucking high, isn't it? Not gonna do it though. I'm a double one. Shit. Oh god. Double one into Kaz. Not what you need escaping, is it? I was trying to go for the save play as well. I tried to go for the save play, run around, and then blitz him and, you know, just get things back. But um, I wasn't counting on the one in 36 into Kaz. Uh, oh man. Took so much for going up 2 0, eh? Shit. Burned. Thirty six percent of uh well nearly thirty seven yeah. with just trolling is pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, he's in a pretty great position, he's gonna knock down all my players here. I'm gonna have literally I'm gonna have no standing players. He's in a pretty great position. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty it's a pretty cool thing, isn't it? Maya. Yeah, the wrestle, the 2D uphill with wrestle is looking like the unfortunately kind of necessary play at this point, isn't it? I'm going to eat a banana, so I'm going to turn off the camera for a little bit.
Hmm. Back to back double ones as first actions. Uh, <laughs> not good. Not good. Yeah. Yeah, that was. Maybe I shouldn't stop that guard guy, but obviously, I mean, I wanted to make it one dice if I could, didn't I? Does he even block or does he just go for the GF? Ah, he's got to go for the three dice with block. It's too good, isn't it? Literally too good. He, uh, he has to go. Well, he didn't. He hit with a random dude. But he got to hit with a mighty blow, haven't you? Got to go with a mighty. I know it's three dice, but he's got block and mighty blow. Or maybe he wanted to hit him. Yeah, the first thing was getting my guy stood up to get hit by mighty blow. True. I forgot about that. Come on, double one. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair play to him. Fair play to him. That was, nah, it was bad by me. Uh, maybe I overcommitted because uh, you know he had limited time to score. But obviously, unlucky to double one those two. I think. Seventy-seven and a half. I'm thinking of making a second account just so that I can have it. <laughs> Make a second account called Gymnarian, <laughs> or it's only it's only what else? So I can have a, I can have like an eighty percent one or something, whatever it is, whatever it would be. Should be able to. I mean, it's a bit harder with the, uh, you know, obviously, it's gonna there's gonna be dice rolls, isn't there? And there's gonna be uh, the disturbing presence might be a factor. Depends. I've got claw, so that discourages him putting claw on uh, arm and arm and the thing. Oh, yes. I wouldn't say it's terrible. I mean, it just—it's just a three plus instead of a two plus, isn't it? No, I mean, you might even remove them, of course. So. Right. You can try to get the touchdown. Oh, the guy who's going to get the pass is fucking dying. You can try and get the pass. Come in there with him, I guess. Let's push him. Which pushes him, which pushes him out of the range of this one. Um, right, so two D there, which pushes him out to there. Second block. I want to be able to block him. Second block pushes in the second one. He only needs two pushes in there, doesn't he? So first block pushes him to there. Second block pushes him there. Um If this is a POW, then uh, I feel bad. Maybe I should do with a rogue, I don't know. I don't like doing with a rogue at all. Especially if you roll a one, couldn't you? I guess having the rogue here is better. Then I could push and then push him in as well. Mm. Two, 
Ha ha ha, Johnny. Ah, he wrote in the playoffs. <laughs> oh god, that was all. Should have had him fucking two back, maybe. Trying to work out what I could do with a rogue. I should have thought it before, shouldn't I? So I guess I didn't need to. Uh, didn't need to re-roll it. But it probably was <laughs> the right play to re-roll. Oh no, because I had this block here, didn't I? Oh, idiot. Didn't need to, uh... Didn't fucking need to re-roll it, did I? I had this block. Did not need to re-roll it at all. Disturbing presence, probably gonna cost me though. Did not need to re-roll it, shit. <laughs> yeah, good old Skaven, yeah. Yeah, I haven't played. I haven't played Skaven in long enough and I forgot how completely ridiculously easy it is to get two pushes. <laughs> so, yeah, and he did do a tight LOS, which made it a lot easier as well. Kazdakai, how many does he have? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten now. So there's ten V ten. Yeah, I shouldn't have re-rolled that. But then I guess I would roll the power of the rogue, which would have been alright as well. And then I would have had to, no, I wouldn't have had to re-roll his guy, so yeah, yeah, I didn't have to do it. Didn't have to re-roll it at all. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, rest of development. Well, I've got it now. I've been, I've been playing dwarves for the last fucking 30 games. <laughs> I mean, there's still a chance to win here, isn't there? Claw can do things. Roger can do things. Yeah, there was just so many ways to do that. And I was thinking I shouldn't re-roll this when I did it. But, um... Did it anyway. <laughs> Maybe it's capital P, Pedro. Maybe that's what you need. <laughs> Thanks, Johnny Five. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> right. I should have scored that one time, I think. Or at least had the re-roll for it. Wrong 
claw him. Claw him to fuck. <laughs> Stop rolling like this! <laughs> there were three good games. Now I'm back to this rolls. Now I'm back to these fucking rolls, eh? I'd roll like a normal person today. Stop being shit! I'd roll like a fucking normal person. For three games. Three games of rolling normally. And now... Double one, double one, triple one. <laughs> Holy shit. And now he gets fucked by the beast instead of the other way around. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Yeah, of course the armor break comes. Yep, yeah, cast. Of course he is. 11 as well, notice. Notice that it was the rolls, even though my guy's armor 8, the rolls were such that I would have cast the beast if I had been able to do it. Surprises no one. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Epiphany would help, wouldn't it? I'd just do nothing. I'd just pass the turn every turn. <laughs> I'll just fucking pass the turn every turn. See what happens. Okay. Oh. oh, he even pushes him into the beast, doesn't he? Fuck off. Doesn't push me into the beast. I'd argue that was a misplay. It wasn't just as soon as I it soon as I had four gutters as well. I I like three gutter runners. Maybe I shouldn't have got the the fourth gutter until I went up to twelve players. I like three gutter runners. <laughs> Rest of the three on the pitch. I don't really like four on the pitch. I mean, I've got three on the pitch now due to having one kill. <laughs> well, badly hurt. Yeah, it was a huge, really stupid. Handoff players getting ruined by uh, disturbing presence is pretty shitty, though. Oh, this fucking game. No, he'll do so, but he's not. He's not failing anything. 
they suck a lot less when they don't fail. And I'm the one failing one in 36 moves at the first action, you know? I've, I've been the one failing things rather than him being the one failing things, which is a big difference for Nurgle, really. Nurgle do get really good eventually. <sighs> I don't even know what I'd do. I really fucking don't know what to do. I double one first time. Mm. <laughs> yeah, again. <laughs> again. <laughs> Rough. Pretty rough. And I don't have a block cutter to, to run the ball either, so it's. Yeah, I might have two heavy. But he's got his two plus guy back, so. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking game, though. Holy shit. But you know, I misplayed on the on the one turn, so not scoring that is my plan is my fault. End of the day. I should have had a reroll for the four plus catch. Didn't. Hide in the corner just doesn't do a lot, does it? It's the problem. It's not AV7, it's one of those games where Edge 4 doesn't work. You know? That's the thing. Fail three. Three double ones first action is, uh, is brutal, isn't it? Yeah, the, losing a line right isn't the end of the world. Or, it <laughs> doesn't matter at all. <laughs> In the grand scheme of things, ah, you want you want reserves, obviously, eventually. Oh, if you get sent off here, then that's pretty good. Well, it doesn't get sent off. I want to go the other side to the dude, right? So let's just dodge him out first. Right. You can one dice him. Put a GFI in there. Blitz him. For a 1D and I can dodge away. And then he can dodge away. No, he's covered the whole screen. He's covered the whole pitch in just open presence. I mean, he's he's not even a cage corner, so I think going through this way is the best. I'm making this GFI. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. And blitzing here. Dodging out. And <laughs> dodging him out. Yeah. So close. <laughs> All right. That's about, that's about as good as a turn as I could have had, I think. I think. <laughs> Maybe I should have GFI'd again so I was in scoring range. In fact, probably should have definitely GFI'd again so I was in scoring range. Yeah. Should have probably definitely GFI'd again, shouldn't I? Probably should have definitely GFI'd. Now that I think about it, I had to get in scoring range. Mona Dodge actually worked. Call the cops. I mean, I didn't have any option, did I? That was the only way I could vaguely make a screen. This has got nobody activating the beast now. No, oh, yeah, 100% should have made the GFI there. Could have cost us the reroll, but on the other hand, I think I would have. Needed the GFI. Yeah, he can be hit easily, but he, he, he needed the power, didn't he? No, he just needed a push. GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. GFI to hit him still. But if he pushes me, oh, he can't he push me sideways. Maybe he won't. <laughs> Johnny for that. Yeah, I should have made the GFI for sure. I had to get in the scoring range. We could make it three dice, yeah. Yeah, I should have. Oh, I should have hundred percent got in scoring range. Fuck. Because like it's going fucking south now, isn't it? It's fucking going south. You would have needed a GFI, other oh, right, but mean two dice. Mm. This is a fine angle. But yeah, if he was just going to make two dice, he should have blitzed with a lot of yeah, for sure. Wow. Wow. What a shocker. What a shocker of a push. Unbelievable, Jeff. Why did you do that? Wow. Wow. There you go. Yeah. Um... I could dodge out here, dodge in there, two dice him or something, and then two dice him. I think I just have to go the GFIs though. Like, I could have maybe tried to have stalled somehow there, but fuck it. I'm just gonna, <laughs> just gonna take, take the not losing, and obviously might, might be able to win. I don't know. This really fucking hurts, doesn't it? No fucking players. Blitz into three one, yeah, that'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? <laughs> Blitz into three one would be pretty good. No. Oh. 
trapping me with the twos. Yeah, I, I, I mean, it was his his spot was that bad that I could have I could have stalled it there for a turn. I think I really think I could have stalled it for another turn. But after rolling so many one in thirty sixes first action, I just thought, fuck it, I'll just go for the score and see what happens. But yeah, I probably should and could have stalled it for another turn or two then. Probably should have done. That was probably bad. Just doing the GFIs there. But on the other hand, it had the bonus of probably tilting him to death, seeing as he pushed me into range. <laughs> Good kick. <laughs> right next to the ball carrier. <laughs> Give him an extra reroll as well. <laughs> oh, fuck. No, he gets to, that was a horrible follow. He could have just blitzed and got all three gutters on him. That was terrible by me. Oh, God. It's all going tits up. I can still do it anyway. He can still just go around this side. Oh, oh fuck. Nah, I probably can't do fuck all now. Cause I, I, yeah, beast blitz into gutters is horrific for me, isn't it? One, two, three, four. All three of them. That was a horrible setup. Because I was thinking of the blitz, you know, I was going to put them further back and then I thought, oh, well, what if I get a blitz? Oh. Come on, really stupid. Need you now more than ever, really stupid. Come on. Ah, oh, fuck. Ooh, he didn't die. We can just base up everybody, can't we? Yeah. It's a duck at it. <laughs> I mean, a draw's okay. I'll, I'll keep them with three wins and a draw. It's, a draw isn't the end of the world. But um, it's disappointing, isn't it? Disappointing to be using the most overpowered race in the game and uh, and not win, but well, I had significantly less options. To be fair, Christoph, uh, if I if I was set up further back, I can't take I can't capitalize on a blitz. But then by doing that, I did give him all three. Uh, all three gutters was not bad. Wow, he went for the three plus pickle. That's that's twice he's gone for the three plus pickle instead of the two plus. Against Skaven. He's just literally chosen to make a more risky action against Skaven of all teams. Um, no, well, I think I think I think Woodells are the best team, but I think I remember one time somebody said, "What's the most overpowered team?" And I thought, you know, if you class over what you know what things are overpowered in Blood Bowl would be one natural one turning and claw pump and fireballs. And blitz kickoff result, and Skaven benefit the most from blitz kickoff and fireball, and they have claw, and they have the easiest natural one turns. So, <laughs> you know, when they have everything, and um, they're pretty good, aren't they? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. GFI, GFI. Is that what you were talking about down the covers? Yeah. Yeah. Run around here. It's an option. It's just this is just horrible, though, isn't it? I was thinking of one dicing here and then moving gutters round. All round, but it's not. It's just horrible, isn't it? Yeah, but I, if I do that. If I just red dice with the wrestle gut of again, I can just get stuck on the beast. So I don't really want to declare a blitz with any of those. Three, three, two, two for a one dice is probably, <laughs> probably the fucking best. Uh, 
Yeah, the dwarf blocker stat line is also pretty good, but I guess so. But it, that's less obviously overpowered than. Oh, this is horrific, isn't it? Like, I don't have to turn him over and score again. I've just got to stop him scoring, haven't I? At the moment, he's got three turns. He's got an edge three player there, and he's got three edge three players over here. An edge three player here. So if I just fucking, you know, hedge my bets, maybe it'll be all right. It's easy to see you'd be freeing them up. Three plus, three plus, three plus, I guess, would free would free them all up. Maybe that's what I could have done. Would not have freed them up without both them. <laughs> Heavy. Yeah, it's really not good against elves though. The beast is good in games you were gonna win anyway. That's what I that's what I believe. And that's what it's doing, isn't it? It's locking down a game that he was massive favourite. What at this to this point now, and it's still a draw anyway. He's still not gonna win. At best for him, it's a draw. I like to go sure hands, KL Zeddy. I like to go sure hands because I find that as lizard men, the way the the only way that I don't win the game is if I fail a million pickups. So uh, yeah, I tend to go sure hands. Yeah, it's only three and all at the moment, Crystal Hunter. Only three and all. Lizards are pretty OP at low TV. Yeah, yeah, they are pretty OP. When you uh, when you just look at the stats, though, you know they're ridiculous. But obviously, it's only really at low TV. And with Skaven, it's only once they get you know some some more skills than what they have at the moment. Like they can still do a lot with movement nine and agility four, but they only get really ridiculous once they've got you know, um, claw palm and one turns and everything. Yeah, claw hundred percent, no exceptions. Yeah, yeah you shouldn't even block this wrestle guy. Should you? you should just keep them all, all locked down by the beast. Yeah, I guess, yeah, that's true, Hippie, yeah. If everybody, literally everyone in your league is Amazon, then there's kind of no point. Um, I can uphill block that block guy for a push. And then I can dodge for one dice on the ball. It's about the best I'm going to get, isn't it? Oh. Can one dice him for a push now. Oh no, because I've got oh, I've got to dodge with him. Okay. Oh, you fucking cunt. Oh, you fucking cunt.
front side. I don't know if this way's got the guard there. Rather keep a Vestigor occupied, wouldn't I? Oh, this is fucking rough, this, isn't it? Ugh. Yeah, there's no piling on in, in tabletop anymore. Hello, Nightwind Bloodball. Um, I just got block. It's so horrible not having block on this fucking guy. He's been knocked down so many times by a block. Yeah, you have a killer who's just not very good at it. <laughs> right, so one turn left. I've got a reroll for it. And he's not going to be able to protect the ball that well, is he? One good runner got free from the beast. So I can get an assist for sure because he's got the guard. Yeah, I mean, they're not getting piled on, are they, Braumeister? So I guess so. Favour Skaven more. Yeah, I guess it does. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I guess it's Favour Skaven and Elves. But then on the other hand, there's the targeted MVP, which is a thing. There's, there's, a, there's a lot of aspects to it. And the restarting, the uh, redrafting and everything. So, like, Dwarves are pretty good. Dwarves guarantee that whoever gets a Kaz gets a level up and into guard, and then, you know, they're low TV, so... Yeah, exactly. It just does mean more attack on guard. Yeah, exactly. I think it's pretty nice for, pretty nice for dwarves, really. Just depends, doesn't it? But the redrafting and everything's different. Yeah, but tabletop tournaments, you know, piling on wasn't a thing in tabletop tournaments anyway. <laughs> Johnny Five. <laughs> Well, okay, piling on was a thing in tabletop tournaments, but only ogres going for most cars, so effectively not a thing. No, he activates the beast. Interesting. Okay, no problem. Huge foul now, isn't it? Huge foul. Huge foul. The game here on this foul. All glorious. So gonna get two dice in the ball if I make the dodge. I mean, obviously I have to go for it. Well, I'll say I'm gonna get two dice in the ball. <laughs> have the uh, have the chance to get two dice on the ball. Him. There's no point him going around anywhere. Definitely not going through. So it's just literally three plus for two dice. Maybe they'll put this guard in the wrong place. Maybe. It's a pretty good spot. Maybe this guard was in a bit of a shit spot, actually. It is a glorious guard, yeah. yeah. I forgot that, like, he still had three guys who could score. Which, <laughs> in case you're wondering, isn't, isn't good play. <laughs> Not good play to forget who can score and who can't. Double GFI here. Yeah, that's probably worth it, isn't it? He could GFI. GFI pick it up. Is that worth it? 
Knocking him down is, is alright, but not really worth it. Do I just base him? So that all of his edge guys are based? And the ball's based as well? Yeah, sorry, Johnny Five. I base them all. Three can score. It's got three players that can score. But if I base all of them, and the ball's based as well, then I think that's the best way. Cut a guy here, put a guy here, scatter the ball. Yeah. I think it's the play. Then it screens him from getting pushed on the ball. It's all right, isn't it? Four plus three plus. I mean, th these weren't going to do anything with it, so it was always worth going for the dodges after at the end. <sighs> Fucking Skaven, eh? What other team could even could even just do that? It's just they are stupid, but they're always on the fucking on their ass end, aren't they? That's the thing. <laughs> like Skaven are always on the edge of destruction, whereas uh, lizards. Lizards are just dominating people until they don't anymore. Yeah, that's great forcing him to push him there. Isn't it? That's actually great. Oh no, he gets to surf he gets to scatter it this way. Oh Maybe I should have put him here. But he, he no, it was it was it was hard to stop him blitzing this guy, didn't I? I had to. I had to stop him blitzing this guy. I think this was the right play. Maybe one up. Maybe one up would have been good. Don't know. Done it now anyway. So he's going to get the scatter. No, he's not. <laughs> Has to re-roll it. Doesn't get it. Woo! GG. Fucking hell. He was unlucky there, obviously. One in 80, one in there. You know. <laughs> he was unlucky there, but I think I was unlucky with my 1 in 36. Um, in 1 in 36 in, uh, you know, dodge, fail, death and all that stuff. But that was, he was obviously horribly unlucky at the end. Oh, wow. Nice winnings. I guess I do buy this shithead lineman with five star player points. Because why not? Yeah, okay. Three hundred break versus twelve. GG. That was horribly tough. Shouldn't have been, should it, against Nurgle? Um, but he definitely made loads of dodges. Thirty-eight. That's horrible. Foul appearances. Seventy-five. Going for it's eight out of eight. Four out of four pickups. Only activated the beast there, the rogue, five times. And. Uh, he made eighty percent pickles despite going for three pluses. Failed. It was one dodge, wasn't it, that he rolled and failed. <laughs> That's disgusting, isn't it? You play against Skaven, you're like, fuck's sake, I made one dodge in the entire game and I failed it. 
Meanwhile, he was dodging around like a dickhead all game. Oh, double. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh, could go for a second guard. Thanks for playing on my sofa. Thank you. Right, so I guess that's going to be a second guard. Um, and I can buy another lineman now. To go to 12 men, which is pretty good, isn't it? Getting to the point where I want to get rid of the Rolga. Because <laughs> it's... Uh, it's a lot of TV, isn't it? Yes, one in the end, Stotty. Crazily, crazily, he, uh, he, you know, it was unbelievable. Big hand. <laughs> Get out of town. I ain't taking big hand. Yeah, four and zero. Not not a bad start, is it? After after the hot, especially after the horrible start with the other games in Champs Ladder, illuminate because it's black burgers and uh, thingy. Thank you very much, guys, and uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.